Now, folks, Kelly Rowland knows a thing or two about subtle shade. Now, I don't know why this old drama is coming back up, but I'm noticing it's trending again. Back in 2019, a South African radio host dropped a tweet by saying Kelly Rowland is ugly without makeup. Now, it's her opinion, but talk about an opinion that <laughs> couldn't be far more than reality because I don't know if you guys have seen Kelly Rowland with makeup or not. She's gorgeous. I got to keep it a buck. She's gorgeous. But Mdoa, Mdota, whatever her name is, the South African radio host, back in 2021, that's two years later after 2019, she stirs up the issue and stands on the fact that, hey, my opinion is my opinion and Kelly Rowland is ugly. This time she didn't say without makeup. She just said Kelly is ugly. Now, Kelly Rowland... <laughs> She responded, honestly, probably not in necessarily the best way, but in the most epic way. She, I guess, strolled through the radio host social media accounts. Maybe she even had a personal assistant do that for her, but she wore the same outfit, beach wear that is, that the radio host wore while out on the ocean on a boat and basically had a side-by-side -side comparison and man it ain't even close man homegirl look crazy now i will say this kelly i don't think you ever got to respond to things like that it's neither here nor there and me personally i was about to go down the rabbit hole with what i thought about this african host from south africa because i know a thing or two about a lot of foreign blacks from other countries and how they view darker toned women and men and mind you the radio host is not necessarily light skinned but she's of the lighter tone and a lot of them women and men especially the women they view themselves as beautiful despite how her you know physical features appear to be she think it doesn't even matter how gorgeous and attractive a kelly Rowland probably is to some people she's darker than me so just like that she ain't that pretty now i didn't want to dive too deep into that aspect because end of the day she did you know clarify kelly Rowland is ugly without makeup why she went after Kelly Rowland, I don't know. Mind you, she's not just some small-time radio host from another country. She has a huge following. So, yeah, it caused a stir. But for whatever reason, it just started to jump right back again. And it's like, damn, they going in on this woman. One of my favorite responses <laughs> was this Twitter user saying, Now, why would Anthony Anderson call Kelly Rowland ugly? tell me i'm lying and damn jesus long story short is this look if you ain't got nothing nice to say man y'all know the old adage don't say nothing at all because we live in a time where people will come for you and no matter how much y'all think kelly Rowland ain't in the game no more when it comes to being a singer she's doing other things so her following is always gonna be right there I mean, that was not a smart idea, lady. And honestly, I'm going to keep it a buck. You looking like a gap tooth hyena talking about Kelly Rowland uh, is ugly without makeup. Homegirl, you probably need makeup. But look, I'm going to leave it where it's at. I'm curious about y'all opinions on this. Mind you, this was an old beef that's now retrending again. Let me get y'all in the comment section real quick. If you're new to the channel and you aren't subscribed, go ahead and do that for your boy. If you're looking for something to, you know, spark your interest, scroll through my channel and check out other videos I got. But look, this was kind of stupid to be retrending again because this is not what you want to be known for if you're a, you know, she, I wouldn't say A-lister artist right now in terms of celebrity status, but she's at least a B or higher. I'm talking about Kelly. You don't want things like this circulating again because then it makes it look like, you know, you on some petty level stuff, you know, 
it's old let it go but for whatever reason it's retrending again look this was ga on reset tv and i'm gonna holla at y'all fuck you can't get on me i might jump on the stage with a stick on me they're calling back women gotta pick on them they're clocking it big got a dick on it how you watching my live won't click on it i'm a butt on a rolling no tick on it they tell you about rude i got a kick on me i just pray that my dog don't switch on me